Well, welcome back to Farmer Talk. A tarmac trails, and I'm quite excited about this one. It's a cute little circular route. We're here, we're just leaving West Luckham, heading towards Horner. Little village at Exmoor, North Exmoor, near the coast. Big caravan site behind the uh, hedge there. And yeah, basically, I guess this is going around Horner Wood um, or circular. It's not very long, but uh, yeah, if you're looking for a route for your 812 super fast or your McLaren, maybe not for you. And uh, even a full fat Range Rover might be uh, might be a little tight, but. If you want to experience Exmoor pretty much as good as it gets, well, yeah, anyway, let's see. Make your mind up. Bit of stone walling there. Yeah, National Trust. They probably drove into it with their truck and they haven't amended. But this, ah, here. How cute is this? Um, Horner Tea Rooms, Horner, I should say, <laughs> but it's basically known for the tea rooms. And uh, jolly nice they are too. Yeah, quintessential, maybe that's today's word, English hospitality. And uh, a bit tight here as I wiggle along. How could you, does life exist without a cream tea? Maybe not. Coming up now, Horner Clouchum. Let's head off up. That's where we want to go. Now, whoa, straight away we're going uphill quite a bit. You can move over. <laughs> People have no idea how wide their cars are. That's coming, what's coming, what's coming? Nothing. Okay. These trees, look at these beech trees. They're just magnificent. And, oh, sorry. I'm going to be eulogizing a little bit. I have no doubt. Quintessential eulogizing. Oh, we've started well. Autumn colors, they're not quite at that. Well, I don't know, There's, they're pretty good. So I think uh, Luckham Wood is on the left, Horner on the right. And we're just coming up this hill, sort of foothills of Dunkery Beacon, the highest point on Exmoor. Just go right here, nothing around anyway, and head towards this Clouchum place. And this is a pretty well known beauty spot, Weber's Post. There we are. Mark Weber's Post, maybe. It is, uh, Horner Woods are really well known and uh, loads of walks. You could do worse. Were you to be in the area than to park there and go for a walk? And you just, ah, oh, this is lovely, isn't it? Moorland up ahead and above us, quite a lot above us, but we're going down. Quite a long way down. And there's, oh, and these trees, quite a, uh, <laughs> Quite a drop to the right. <clears throat> it's quite a drop to the right. <laughs> Water pouring off the hills. So I think just a cracky that steep down there. Barriered, of course. <laughs> 
just looking out on the top of trees here and you tend to look down there. Whoa, it's a fabulous view. And we're doing um, 18 miles an hour. That's plenty fast enough. There is so much to take in here. I nearly said do it on a push bike, but that means pedalling and <laughs> trust me, this is a steep hill. All right, leveling off a bit. Wow, beautiful tumbling waterfalls to the right. And I think this is East Water. A beautiful Ford down here. A Ford made anything beautiful? Mustang maybe. GT40. Oh, I think that's Bruno. I'm sure. I hope we can get through the wave depth here. Woo. Okay. Onward. Corner wood. Sign says so. Whew. Oh, how pretty is this? So right down in the valley. In the valley. Leaves are definitely turning. Just, we're on the similar level. The, the river is over to the left there. River is very close to us here. There's just sorry, I'm concentrating. I'm seeing it. You are, well, you know, you're seeing it as well. Ah, bit of passing coming up. Very nicely waiting. Thank you very much, Mr. Honda. Happy smiley wave. Oh, this is a bit tight. And off we go back uphill. You're either going uphill or downhill on Exmoor. And we've just gone uphill quite quickly. I think we're just heading in. This Clouchum is an area where it's a farm, I believe, and we're just going around it. Look at those trees. Gosh. Tight, tight, tight. Chickens! Clouchum Farm. Bed and breakfast. Way of the world. Lovely old place. I think in the past this was gated. I seem to remember years ago coming through here and having to open a gate. So, whoop, whoop, tight, 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 tight. These huge trees, beech trees there are roots exposed. Look at that one. Oh, awful lot of trees dying in Devon. Well, anywhere in, Euro in, well, anywhere, Europe. Not good. I think the countryside's going to change quite a lot over the next few years, sadly. Right, now, on the right. Well, we've just come round, around here. And we're going up all the time here and the scenery is about to change. Not like instantly, but there. Sort of breaks out and uh, moorland. Beautiful. 
Where's me camera? I think we're still officially Cloutsome. Cloutsome. It might be Cloutsome. Ooh, I might be in big trouble. And, and yeah, here's the old sign now. I'll come to that later. We'll do the route. But Stoke Perro is just to the right. And uh, Stoke Perro is significant because there is a church there. A very, not a very big church, I have to say. But ancient, I think, 13th century. So uh, the malt has probably gone off by now. And claimed to be the highest church in England. So uh, trot along there and you can rejoice on high. Mm. <laughs> we'll have a look at that later. <laughs> 